what's up yo welcome back to another video today we're going to be teaching y'all how to do the motion blur effect it's going to be like a full guide it's going to be pretty brief it's going to be a full understanding on how to like add the motion blur effect and like what you can do to it and stuff like that i appreciate everybody for tuning in uh make sure you comment what you want to see next uh, we're gonna get straight into the video here but before we get into the video i just want to let y'all know that this video is for everybody uh, including people who can and cannot afford the nb uh series for the nbe and quan b and it's also for people who just want to install motion blur and that's it so i got y'all pay attention to this video and make sure y'all follow along right so the first thing i need y'all to do is to open up google chrome or whatever browser you're using for your search engine so me i'm using google chrome i'm going to open that up and the first thing i'm gonna need you to type and this is for everybody who don't who can't afford like enb for nve and quan v and all that stuff this is for everybody who just want plain motion blur uh, to whatever graphic mod you're using it could be visual v visual vanilla all that stuff make visuals great again it works for anything and it works on plain vanilla gta 2 so the first thing you want to do is look up motion blur as you can see it already popped up for me motion blur mod 5m the first thing that should pop up is motion blur mod i'm gonna have this in a link in the description but if you want to search it up on your own just go ahead you can check it out yourself but this whole link to this website and everything is going to be in the description go ahead copy it right now for my description so yeah so so once you get here you'll see it's actually like a couple presets and they actually show you what it looks like for the motion blur so this is like the weak presets you can see on my screen this is the weak one it's probably it's, it's a little bit of motion blur but it's not that much you got subtle preset so it's like it's like a little bit more than a week you got medium which is pretty good i'll probably recommend that for everybody medium normal and high is probably the best one high is high is probably a little bit over but i mean it's, it's it's definitely it's definitely a preference and then you got intense and you got strong strongest like and insane it's just insane you know you already know you see it uh, you got a couple videos it shows you but uh, yeah this is basically it so what we're gonna do here is download it i'm gonna take you to this page you download it again and it's gonna pop up it should pop up somewhere like up here or down here i think mine's i think google chrome updated so now i started doing this yeah wherever it, it pop up at you want to go to your files i'm just going to close that out you want to go to your files and you want to open motion blur it makes it easier all you got to do is go down here to winrar and you hit open with winrar and then you got all your files right here you don't even need anything else uh you just need the files that's right here so these are all the presets so you got the weak subtle you know everything that i showed you so say you want to go to uh medium it got time cycle mods you go into that folder the medium folder you go into it and you hit time cycle mods you don't click into it or anything you just keep that open drag it to the side um hopefully everybody watched the last the last couple videos where i actually taught you guys how to how to pin your your 5m application data in your gta 5 main directory you don't need the main directory but you do need the data open so just go ahead and open your data 5m application data if you don't know how to get there i'm sorry i'm not going to sit there and teach you you should know how to get to your 5M application data, I'm not gonna lie. So it's been in many previous videos uh, that I created. So definitely check that out. So once you're in your 5M application data, you wanna go to citizen, the citizen folder. You wanna click into that, click into common, click into data. And then you see this, it says UI, game config, or whatever else you got in there. It could be any of your, your visual mods or whatever. It doesn't really matter. It's not gonna conflict. Just make sure you don't already have the same time cycle mods thing going on, the, the same exact like it says time cycle underscore mods underscore one don't have that in there if you have that it's going to replace it so i mean just delete it or replace it whatever just just get rid of it so what we're going to do is just drag that right over here and that's simply how you do it that's simply how you get the motion blur i'm actually going to go into 5m to show you how it looks right now all right so we did all the extra stuff we joined up in the server and now we uh now we're just chilling here we got the we got the bmw right here we're going to go ahead and test out the motion blur we did at the uh the what was it i think we did high so um yeah basically testing it out i did up my uh graphics a little bit you know put everything on high as you can see the ground is already starting to look pretty smooth and stuff with the motion blur we're gonna go ahead and get on the road here oh yeah oh yeah that's real nice that's real nice that is real nice i like that I like that yeah y'all can see y'all can see the motion blur looks real it's beautiful this this shit is beautiful yeah definitely i mean that's pretty much it i ain't gonna lie i mean we can do the second we're gonna do the second part of the video which is basically gonna be me showing you how to install the motion blur but 
for the EMB, Quant B and NBE. It's gonna be real quick. But um this is this is pretty much it. And I highly recommend this mod. It's gonna be link in the description. It's a motion blur mod effect. And yeah, definitely. This is this is real nice. I like it. Jacking it a lot. Mm -hmm. I'm having so much fun. I don't even want to quit. But I mean, yeah, this is pretty much it, y'all. So this is how you, you add motion blur to your game if you don't have any EMB or NVE or can't afford it or don't want to buy it. But yeah, there you go. Let's go ahead and quit out of here real quick. And we're going to go ahead and show you how to install it through ENB. All right, so like I said, this part is real simple. I actually got my uh, 5M Quant V and NVE. I got some older versions. Obviously, these are EMB series versions. Uh, we're not going to show you like the, the whole EMB and in-game version thing. I'm just going to show you how to install it uh, simply because a lot of people have problems and, and troubles installing this. You're going to go to your file explorer. You're going to go to your 5M application data. What are you going to go to mods? And once you're in your mods folder, you can go ahead and hit this double box, bring it down, minimize it, whatever. And then we're going to start off with Quant B. So, you know, the Quant B files usually look different um, than the NVE files. It's still, you know, optional add ons. So, that's all you have to look out for. So, just go to the optional add ons and optional folder, uh, optional presets. You got all this stuff going on right here. Obviously, the one you want to be looking for is motion blur. And then uh, there's three options, removed, enable, and rockstar editor, and just enable it in 5M in general. You want to have the, the one uh, enabled in 5M in general. It's going to say application data. It's going to say mods. And you want to just add this. You want to drag it right over here. Boom. And that's all you got to do. You can exit out everything and go back into game. Same thing with the uh, NVE. So I'm going to go ahead and I know they got rid of EMB for NVE, but you know, I, I figured they still got the optional add ons. I'm not going to lie. So, so for the NVE, you want to go into the optional add ons folder. You clearly see the enhanced motion blur right here. So you want to actually click into that. Don't add the entire folder. Same with these. You don't want to add the entire folder. You want to actually pick your preset. So you got high, you got medium, you got low. So I would probably recommend, well, it's recommended medium. I mean, that's just for everybody. But if you want motion blur, motion blur, like if you really want it to look good, then you're going to go into the eye, you know, and you want to add that over. It's a very simple thing. It's a very simple procedure. I know I probably took long, but you got to understand. I know there's a lot of new players and stuff like that. So I'm just going to, you know, show you all the, the walkthrough step by step. I don't want to be that channel who rushes through everything in the tutorial. So, you know, I got y'all. So yeah, you just do that and you exit out everything and you go into game. You all good. And if you want a bundle, Quant V and 5M, just go ahead and hit me up in my DM. Got it for a low, low price. Both of them together. These are older versions. I'm not selling new versions. I'm also selling parts of the older versions. But that's it. I'm not going to say anything else. I appreciate everybody for watching. If this video helped you, I want you to drop a like. You have to drop a like for me. Definitely check out the rest of the channel and consider subscribing. I appreciate everybody for watching. Thank you to all my supporters and my uh, my YouTube members. Thank you to my Discord members. And uh, definitely go into the Discord. Join the Discord. Link in the description. Suggest some videos to me. Talk to me. And all that good stuff. Um, and that's pretty much it though. You know, I appreciate everybody. Y'all have a good one. Peace out.